Good morning. Welcome to my channel. Um, so I'm continuing this series that I'm doing through the early life of Robert Sylvester Kelly, known as R. Kelly in the music industry. And yesterday I was talking about um, R. Kelly uh, was born uh, to his mom name was Joanna Kelly January 8, 1967 he was brought up in Chicago Lyon, Chicago um, Hypes Parks, Chicago um, he's the third child of four. And um, yesterday I was just talking about being brought up in a medium sized, a big family is tough enough, but being brought up in a medium sized family, which was, was four of them, you have a, diff a lot of different personality challenges. And um, I'm not sure what the, what 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 his relationships were with his uh, siblings, but um, no matter what your situation is in your upbringing, um, it still does not give you the right to break the laws. Um, but today we're going to be continuing, and this is part two. And it gets a little today. It, it kind of explains some of uh, what we're seeing now, or what we have seen in R. Kelly's um, past, and is is uh, just through the years of some of the things that R. Kelly had to deal with um, as a youth, someone young. So today. I'm continuing to read uh, the, the life, the, the early life of R. Kelly. So it says, Robert Sylvester Kelly, his mother was a professional singer. And so we see here R. Kelly, his talent, basically the apple don't fall from, from the tree, as a lot of people like to say. So that's where he really got his, his talent from, is his mom. Uh, his dad, um, we, we'll talk more about that as we get into more into uh, today, what we're talking about today. So his talent came, basically, his singing talent came through his mother, uh, Jeans. Uh, so, it goes on to say um, that his mom read. She raised her children as Baptists. So R. Kelly, he, as you can see there in his life, his music, his spiritual music, um, a lot of this his music uh, was uh, inspired um, from his spiritual upbringing. And that's how he's, he was able to bring some of the music that he brought uh, spiritually. Uh, so that makes sense. Um, and so, it says his mom was a lead, a lead singer in a court in a choir. So she was. His mom had to be a very talented uh, lead singer, someone who was really, really good at, at uh, singing to be a lead singer. So uh, once again, and that's when you see that, that this guy R. Kelly, such a talent. Um, uh, his mom being a great singer also. But, um, so it goes on to say, now this is where it gets really, really, uh, interesting. It says, R. Kelly has never met his father who remains absent in his son's life. So basically R. Kelly dad was not in his life. And, um, this, this is a problem. This is this has always been a problem in our society today. Um, you have men who are basically 
boys in men's bodies who never had a dad, never had anyone of influence to show them what a man was like supposed to be nor had anyone to show a show them how a man's supposed to treat a woman and other things too um so as you see here today you know i mean uh you see some good things about r kelly uh his upbringing uh his mother you know I, I'm, I'm assuming that his mom he had a good relationship with his mother but uh, his talent comes from his mother but his dad not being in his life that contribute to other things that could cause that caused R. Kelly to take some of the some of the choice to make some of the choices that he's made in his life. And my footnotes on this, I just say, well, we see here R. Kelly Got some of his, like I said, some of his talent from his mother. Um, his mom, I'm sure, saw the talent in him as a as a youth that he could sing, and she was probably one of his. She probably didn't encourage him to continue to work on his talent. Um, so we see R. Kelly being brought up in the church. So now those spiritual songs that he made, it makes sense. Um, and that gift came straight from God. That gift that R. Kelly had. But when God gives you a gift, God has a purpose behind it. And his purpose is to glorify him with your talents. Um, no father in R. Kelly's life um, he had really, really no direction, probably just the streets. This is just me assuming. And when you're being led by the streets, you make bad choices. So, we see a man here, um, no father in his life, had a mother, and, uh, that's probably a big contributor to um, what we see in this man um, but that's not the whole that's not the whole thing of R. Kelly and, and it, it's more as we get more into it part 3 is gonna begin to uh, show us more things about R. Kelly um, and we just can't make excuses for life. We, you know, as we grow up, we, uh, our upbringing can affect our present and our future, but we can't use that as an, as an excuse to do wrong. So, this is part two. Hit the subscribe button. Hit the notification, hit the like button, whatever the things that you need to do. I would love it if you would subscribe to my channels. I would continue to bring videos. There will be more of this R. Kelly series. Peace out.